Buju and welcome to the Red Lake Nation College Ginkadasawin podcast. Join us each week for discussions on topics including culture and language, career exploration, RLNC student spotlights, student projects, and other RLNC services. This week we're highlighting RLNC student Ojibwe language projects conducted in Professor Lucas Bratbold's Ojibwe Moan classes. Red Lake Nation College would like to thank the National Endowment for the Humanities for their generous support in the creations of these podcasts. Miigwech! All right. Bonjour, Nijin Nishinabek. Bonjour, Nijin Kikinomagani Dug. Ogimagizik Nindau. Ogimagizik Nindijin Kandigu. Nindu de Madik. Nisquagami Wazaga Egening Nindunjiba. Miguakama, Bequakwang, Bequakwang Gataji Ogi Guyan. Ninda Bendagos, a subokoneza gigining. Mijigo Nui Jaganashim Dinisto, Tawig. I'll switch to English here for a little bit also. So the Ojibwe word I want to share is Bequakwang. 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 That's the word uh, used for the West End area of Red Lake, just west of the the criminal justice complex there, that, all that area there. It's um, the area where I grew up at. That was the, the older name that the elders and stuff used, the Ojibwe name for that area is Bikwakwang. Bikwakwang translates to uh, like a, one of those old dance halls, like the one that's, there's one in Panema now called the Roundhouse. Um, that's what it. That's what it translates to. Was those old, old style roundhouses or dance halls? They called them. The reason it's called the Kwakwang in West End is because back where that, that old field is there. I think where um, Leon Neto lives at right there. Uh, between Leon's and uh, Olivia's, there's a, there's a field there. Still kind of a field there now. And there was that was the, the last standing the Kwakwang in in Red Lake was was in that area. The last one there was that area, so that's why they call that area Bikwakwang. Bikwakwang translates to that um, that dwelling, that that building, I guess. And then I've also heard it translate to a grove of trees. Um, and I think it's kind of sometimes I wonder if a grove it took a grove of trees to make one of those old time dance halls. So e- either way, that's what uh, my understanding of Bikwakwang, the meaning, and that's the area in West End called Bikwakwang. You don't hardly hear it used or called that anymore. You, I guess when I was a kid in that area, you'd hear it called that quite a bit. Uh, Bikwakwang is that area. And then down by the Catholic cemetery, that's called Neashing. That loop back there because of the Neashing means a uh, point in the lake. And that where the creek flows out, there's kind of a point in the in the lake there, out in the lake. So they call that area Neashing. Um, all right, me you. All right, Buju. Ogimagizig Nindao. Word I want to share is, or a phrase I want to share. Uh, I always, uh, I always heard this quite a bit growing up. Ojibwewug. Okay, wait, let me let me start over. Buana Odumwawan Animushan Ojibwewug. Ogidine 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 Wabuzug. So it's Bwanag Odumwawan Animushan Ojibwewag Ogidine Winawan Wabuzug. That's uh, the Sioux eat dogs, the Ojibwe choke rabbits. <laughs> here's, a, here's a phrase. I think there's a first. One of the first phrases I learned Ingi Waswaman Dipikung Ingi Pashkizwag Nijwaswe Wawashkeshiwag. Last night we went shining, I shot seven deer. Ingi Waswaman Dipikung Ingi Pashkizwag Nijwaswe Wawashkeshiwag. We went shining last night, and I shot seven deer. Uh, another phrase that I remember learning was "Ingiwaswaman dipikung." Ingiwaswaman dipikung. 
Ningi Wabama Jean Guishi. We went shining one night, and that was one of the other phrases I learned was, we went shining last night, I saw a mink. Ingi wa swam and dipikung, ingi wa bama jangweishi. Okay, we're gonna do ten phrases. I'll just kind of rattle some off here. <coughs> just kind of start and go down the line. Um, I don't know what number this one is, but I'll start with my maybe with my protocol. So. Ogima gijig, nindijne kandigo. Ogima gijig, nindijne kandigo. My spiritually given name that I am called is Boss of the Sky. My spiritually name given that I'm called is Boss of the Sky. Ogima gijig, nindijne kandigo. Ogima gijig, nindijne kandigo. Okay, next one. Adik nindu dame. A dick nindu dam. A dick nindu dam. I am caribou clan, or I am I am of the caribou clan. Do dam. I am of the caribou clan. A dick nindu dam. Okay, here's another phrase. Misquaga me with zaga igening nindunjiba. Misquaga me with Zaga Igening Nindunjiba. Misquaga me with Zaga Igening Nindunjiba. I am from the Red Lake Reservation. I am from the Red Lake Reservation. Misquaga me with Zaga Igening Nindunjiba. I'm from Red Lake. Okay, next one. Ninda Bandagos. A subokune. Zaga igening. Ninda bandagos. A subokune zaga igening. Ninda bandagos. A subokune zaga igening. I am enrolled or I belong to the Boys Fort Reservation or Net Lake. The Net Lake Reservation. Boys Fort. I am enrolled in the Boys Fort Reservation. Literally, I belong to the to that reservation. Ninda Bandago is a subokoneza giggening. Okay, next one, next phrase. Nimin Wandam, Waba Minan. Nimin Wandam, Waba Minan. I am glad to see you. I am glad to see you. Nimin Wandam, Waba Minan. Okay, next phrase. Giwe de no kwe is in the kandigo. Giwe de no kwe is in the kandigo. Her spiritually given name is North Wind Woman. Her spiritually given name is North Wind Woman. Giwe de no kwe is in the kandigo. Giwe de no kwe is in the kandigo. A dick, a dick one, oh do daemon. A dick one, oh do daemon. A dick one, oh do daemon. She is of the of the caribou clan. She is from or of the caribou clan. A dick one, oh do daemon. Misquagami wasaga igening onjiba. Misquagami was Zaga Igening Onjiba. She is from Red Lake. She is from the Red Lake Reservation. She is from Red Lake. Misquagami was Zaga Igening Onjiba. Da Asanisikang. Da Asanisikang. Or you could say it Asanisikang Da. She lives in Little Rock. She lives or dwells in Little Rock. Da Asanisikang. Giwe no kwe da Asanisikang. 
Giwaid Nokwe Da Sanisika. North Wind Woman lives or dwells in Little Rock. Ogoza's son. Giwaid Nokwe Ogoza's son. Lorenzo Ijinikazo. Giwe no kwe o goza son. Lorenzo is in North Wind Woman's son. Son's name is Lorenzo. Is he is called Lorenzo. Giwe no kwe o goza son. Lorenzo is in Nicazo. Giwe no kwe o goza son. Lorenzo is in North Wind Woman's son, Lorenzo, he is called, is what he is called. His name is Lorenzo. Okay, here's a couple more phrases I'm just kind of thinking of. Think ones you can like use over the phone or on a message. Gigaganunin, gigaganunin, nagaj. I will call you later. Gigaganunin Nagaj. I will call you later. Gigaganunin Nagaj. Gigaganunin Nagaj. I'll call you later. Here's another phrase. Ajay Ganujashin. Ajay Ganujashin. Ajay Ganujashin. Call me back. That's call me back. Call me back. You can leave that message for somebody on the phone. Like they don't answer, you can Ajay Ganujashin. Call me back. Ajay Ganujashin. There's another one. Anindi and Dayan. Anindi and Dayan. Where do you live at? Or literally, kind of like, where's your house at? Where do you live at? Anindi and Dayan. Anindi and Dayan. Where's your house at? Or where do you live at? Buju Ozawa Benesi Kwe Nindijnaka Makwa Nindonim Ogakani Nindunjaba Bungi Etago Nunita Ojibwem. Hello, my name is Selena Beasley, and I am here with Erin Kelly. We will be recording some Ojibwe phrases for the Red Lake Nation College Knowledge Podcast. Buju, Erin Kelly, Indigenous College, Jaganashimang, Manomana Kegi, Sasukwe, Indigo, Azawe, Makwan, Dudem, Gakavakang, Indunjaba, um, Miskwa Gamiwe Zakai Ganing um Indaya Nongum Um Number one Bejig Mani Nan Bakwe Shigan Sag Mieji Ojiman Oji Mian After I give you cookies that's when you kiss me Nij Gamikwandaman Mi Gai Ji Gidoyan after I remembered it, I said it. This way, Megwa gi nimi yang gi min wendamug. While we danced, they were glad. Niwen, gosh gwa we siniwad gi bakadewad ge avi. After they ate, they were still hungry. Nanin Gawin Gay goes in the May on Um There is no toilet paper. <laughs> oh wow. Alright, well me Gwetch Bizenda Yewab Thank you for listening. Anish Ejiwe Bak Aguajing Nungwa. What is happening outside today?
Gisena na nongwa is it called Gizukipun ona is it snowing Gijibakwe na are you cooking Kide kidogo gimse na do you snowshoe Minogijigut na nungwa is it nice today Gigijade ona is it hot today Anishmanik how much Gimimituk ona what is wrong Gigune ke na do you fish We hope you enjoyed this week's episode. Be sure to join us next week as we shine the spotlight on one of our top students, Mitchell Johnson, as he discusses with Michael Whitecloud the joys of being a student at RLNC. Miigwech. Achi miigwech to the following for their efforts in the creation of this Red Lake Nation College Geek and Daswin podcast episode. Opening and closing music by Director of Equity, Cultural Education and Archives, Lloyd Buck Jordan. Opening introduction and closing preview by Recruitment and Retention Coordinator and Director of Social Media, Michael Whitecloud. Our hosts this episode are LNC graduates, Selena Beasley, Nicole Brunn, and Alyssa Gralla. Our guest speakers this episode, Aaron Kelly, Jeff Widner, and Charles Gralla. Production by Innovation Center Coordinator, Brandon Spears and the National Endowment for Humanities for their generous support. Miigwech and have a good day.